Hey everyone, Ryan here. So now one of the entrances here are Star Wars Galaxy Edge. Set to be open on May 31st. But just checking out this area. It looks like it's nice and wide and everything. There's going to be also two other entrances to the park. Uh, there's one further down, down here by uh, Thunder Mountain. And the other one will be, actually be over in Critter Country. So you can actually pass through and have a path towards that way. It will come directly back here just as well. So let me get you closer to see what this looks like up here, okay? It's gonna be behind Big Thunder Mountain here, which is kinda cool. So you'll be walking this way. I, I, it's too bad I just missed the train, but the train just uh, passed by. And it, <laughs> it's pretty cool. So you, you walk under the small little bridge here and you approach this big one. Actually, it won't be like this at May 31st, but you got this this is what, what, what it will look like. Well, somewhat like this, hopefully. Your pictures make it, things look so good. So uh, once you go in there, it'll probably be a little different. I gotta get this say. So let me see. Should I, should I check behind the door? I might get in trouble. Oh, pad door. <laughs> I saw everybody else uh, doing it. So I don't think they might. I think everybody wants to do it. So uh, let me check out the other locations for you to see what I can get to give you a preview of what Star Wars Land will look like. And it will be open now May 31st. And that's just a couple weeks away. I wanted to point this out too because this is one of the cool things about Disneyland now. You guys can see here, there's no smoking, including vaping and all that in the park now. So that's cool. Because this is actually a section right up right here where it was before and now it's not going to be allowed because of Star Wars Galaxy Edge being back here. We have to get more space to make sure there's no smoking allowed now. <laughs> I think it's a good idea. Here, Big Thunder up there. I'm passing right in back of Big Thunder and show you the other entrance over by Fancy Land now. Okay, so right behind Big Thunder here, there is another entrance. I just try to cut in front of people, sorry. But I'm going to come down here to that pathway to show you another entrance to get into Galaxy Edge. So I haven't been, been here a while at this entrance. Pretty, pretty nice, I gotta say. Here's what it's going to look like uh, coming in into this side. You can see a stagecoach uh, broken down. <laughs> it's the old west. Big fender thing. But of course, you got this big wooden door. And like I said before, once May 31st comes, this big wooden door won't be here anymore. This will be a pathway into Galaxy Edge coming from this direction. So that's, should, I just showed you the air side, and this will mark the other entrance. And like I said, the other one will be in Critter Country, because if you guys can remember over there by the Haunted Mansion, by Splash Mountain, uh, there's gonna be entrance over there by Splash Mountain. It's gonna uh, come all, all around. I, I already, pretty much already said this already. But it wraps up and coming right back here once again. So they're just trying to make more pathways because a lot of people probably will be out here for May 31st. I, I did get reservations, so I'm going to have to hold off for quite a while. It will be a couple months probably, probably towards the end of the year. But I, don't, I also want to make sure I don't come at a crowded time just as well. So I, I'm going to say what I could do to help uh, see what I could see behind these wooden doors. I wish I could get back there. Wouldn't that be cool? Get a tour or something like that. I don't think that's going to happen, but anything's possible here at Disneyland. So if, if, if anything, if, if I can get shots, it would be just uh, shots pretty much from a long distance, like Big Thunder Mountain or something like that. Uh, if I happen to go on uh, the Mark Train boat, I, I might get something from that maybe too. So we'll see what I could do. We're going to hop on the train here to see what I can show you. You can see it a little bit off the distance. I don't think their train's really the best from this. So I think what I'm going to do is hop across the other side of where the train is, which is the Mark Train Riverboat. So let me get some views from the Mark Train Riverboat. Here we go. This is a lot more better view from the train because it's a train I couldn't get the best shot, but. But the Mark Train Riverboat, this looks Just wonderful, i got to say. Don't you think? Now, if you were to go over on Big Thunder Mountain at the very top peak, you could get pretty much all the detail, most of the detail anyways, uh, from uh, what the inside of the Galaxy Edge looks like. But i got to say, this looks pretty good from the Riverboat. to the 
side of the river. Okay, there's a guitar in this wagon. Should I draw attention to uh, the visitors here and maybe employees? Maybe the employees might let me into this uh, Galaxy Edge right now. Maybe seeing something like, let me in into Galaxy's Edge over here by Big Thunder Mountain. <laughs> something like that. <laughs> I'm being silly. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up and say my name is Ryan. Thank you for watching. Make sure to give me those thumbs up and subscribe. And I hope you guys are really excited with Galaxy Edge coming out May 31st. Thank you for watching.